Hannah here and welcome to my YouTube channel. Today I've just gathered up a few questions that I'm going to answer for you guys just so that you can get to know me a little and yeah but before I start the video please like and subscribe to this channel if you're watching it will be muchly appreciated. Let's get to it. Let's get to a moment. So I am wearing just this little cute glass ones top. It's like a halter neck. The good thing about this top is that you don't have to wear a bra. So good. And I'm just wearing like these khaki shorts. And I think they're from Moire. But from a long time. So you pronounce my full name as Shania Courtney Lavendua. It's pretty simple, pretty easy. A lot of people call me Shania. Shania, if they get it mixed up. All my life I always thought I was a Taurus until just recently, I think a couple of months ago, I figured out that I'm on the cusp. So my birthday is on the 23rd of April and I am half Aries and half Taurus. So I have a little bit of characteristics from the Aries zodiac sign. I'm from Melbourne and down in the southeast space in the southeast. <laughs> Next question is next question is so my ethnicity is Mauritian I was born here obviously dad was the only one that was born in Mauritius in the family but yeah shout out to all my Creoles you guys I am 21 turning 22 this year so I've always been the baby of the group in high school in anything like I've, it's just something different I have my mom I have my dad I have my brother and me and then I also have my own family and there's just the three of us so that's just me mike and dre he's actually eight months this month he was eight months on the 22nd which is so exciting my passion. my passion has been dancing my whole entire life ever since i was four i started off with ballet contemporary jazz hip as everyone does when they start dancing and then it got to a point where i was like nah i'm not a ballet girl nah i'm not a contemporary girl nah i'm not a jazz girl stuck to being hip-hop and I've done like a few gigs here and there. So that it's been like a big, big role in my life. And I don't think I could ever, ever see it not being in my it's life. Just, it's just been there for so long. Anyone that knows me knows that that's been a part Next of question my question is, where have you traveled in the world? Where have you traveled in the world? So I have traveled a couple of places, usually with my family, mum and dad always try to make sure we go overseas every second year so i've been going overseas every second year i've done interstate as well but the overseas trips that i've done are mauritius i've done fiji i've done vanuatu i've done thailand i've done canada so it'd be pretty cool places to go to i'd recommend um the best place i'd say was canada and mauritius mauritius obviously because there was just so many family that i just got to meet and it was just so good just to experience my culture yep. too so everything everything is amazing when you're young everything is so exciting when you're young so it was really really good second best place was canada you guys you have to go to canada I stayed with one of my family friends and it was really really hot so we went in the summer and it's like it's like melbourne but not like melbourne at all <laughs> it's one fact about canada is that they're not allowed to drink in public which is really good it's really really safe for people to bring their kids even at night time like you can go to the park and you wouldn't worry of anything which is so good like you need that in the world but yeah they're the two places that i really really loved and enjoyed oh and another one thailand thailand was so dope you guys because i went for my uncle's wedding and the family all went down too so everyone was with each other every day we did things that place is also hot so um, it's another tropical place that we've been to but yeah so them three are actually the best places that I've, I've been to pretty much next question is what is a restaurant you go to the restaurant that I go to all the time is schnitz schnitz has been in my life I reckon since last year every time me and Michael are like deciding where to go eat we go there like that's our sanctuary that's where we go because the chips and chicken are so dope um, they're so good so good actually i have a cat and a dog the dog is named jack 
and the cat is named Coco. So they're both boys. Um, Coco is one and Jack is about like seven years in doggy. I've always had bad skin ever since I was young, ever since year eight, I'd say. And it's always gotten the best of me. It's so annoying. But yeah. And my teeth. I don't like my teeth. My teeth are gross. I hate them. Which way do you face in the shower? So when I'm washing my body, I'm like facing the actual water tap. That's how I, that's how I face in the shower. <laughs> embarrassing moment. Okay. One embarrassing moment is, <gasps> yup. So I think it was year nine. I used to catch the bus to school and from school. Two of my good girlfriends used to be on the bus and we were sitting because, no, actually, no, no, it was year seven. So you'd have all the year nines at the back. Some girlfriends were there and before I got off the bus, they knew, they knew I was getting off the bus. I stood up because it took so long to get your bag as well because there's so many bags around. You're just like trying to find your bag. So I found my bag as soon as I bent over. I was wearing shorts by the way because I think it was sports day. I was wearing shorts and I'm saying your name, Natasha. Natasha pulls my pants, my shorts down. She pulls my shorts down so you can see my undies. I was wearing pink undies. And I got so embarrassed because everyone saw and everyone was laughing. Like, wow, just before I get off the bus. Just before I get off the bus. So yeah, that's one embarrassing moment for you guys. Um, so that is all the questions done. So if you guys did enjoy, please like and subscribe as I said at the start and let me know. Don't be afraid to comment down below to tell me what you guys would want for my next video or for any other video. So I'll see you in my next video. Bye.